Good afternoon, Subby family. <clears throat> Sorry about the light overhead here. I'm in here in the kitchen. Just got my phone sitting here on the countertop. We went to Walmart last night and bought up, well, we bought a few groceries and things that we needed and things like that. So, probably should have turned the TV down in the background. Um, so, hang on a minute. <laughs> okay. I'm not going to get those out because they're heavy. I'm not going to bring them back over here. But we got um, a 24-pack of Ozarka water and a 20, I think it's a 24-pack of Walmart brand water. Gary likes that. I like the Ozarka. So we got those and uh, two six packs of um sprite soda let's see if i can no i don't know anyways so i may not show everything it wasn't just a regular grocery haul i just we just picked up a few things while we was there so i wanted to share them with you you know i got me a big thing of my suavadel Suavitel, whatever, because I love this fabric softener so much. And this was, okay, you get 3.28, it's a 3.28 quart, which is 105 full ounces uh, for $8 and something. I'm not going to tell prices of everything because y'all know, y'all pretty much know what Walmart prices are. But. I picked up that I have been aiming to pick me up some more celery salt forever and I keep forgetting it well last night it just popped in my head and I said yeah so I looked for the spice aisle and went down there and this time I got a big one and this is good till March 11th 2024 and, you know, spices just lose their oomph as time goes by. But spice does not really spoil. So, I mean, I, I use my spice for a long time until I can think about buying extra or to replace it. That's the way I do it anyway. Got to pick up another uh, extra virgin olive oil because we, that's what we use. Okay, got one. I don't know why I just got one. I guess because it was just like, a, I'm, I want to say weird shopping, but I, <laughs> I don't know. It's one of those times that you just didn't want to, I didn't feel good anyway. I was tired and uh, so just picked up one. Now. When we had the ice storm, we're supposed to have an ice storm that passed us up. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Thank you to the Lord. Um, Walmart got cleared out of <laughs> a lot of the chicken. Everybody was after the chicken broth. So all they had was low sodium or they had no sodium. And I'm thinking, what kind of broth is that with no sodium in it at all? Yeah. So anyway, they they had the okay, the Walmart brand was wiped out uh, in this size, and um, they had the more expensive. But I'm you know, if I can't, don't have to pay that price, I'm not going to because why would you? <laughs> this is a dollar and something. I can't remember now. So I only picked up one beef. I guess because we don't do beef very often and i've been wanting beef here lately i guess maybe i'm kind of getting tired of chicken so lily get out of the get out of the grocery bag get out of the grocery bag lily get get out of there yeah you get out of that no 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 she's in the grocery bag this is the big family size. This is all they had in the chicken broth. It's a 
three pounds and this here is two pounds which to me seems like this is more than that you know because it's quite bigger but it is shorter so i gotta go to aldi and find my uh as i call it my ice cream it's my frozen dessert i went through the freezer at what i have in there and a lot well most of it is has uh expired the expiration date or best buy and with something like that i don't want to don't want to fool with you know just don't um but that's okay i've been forever i've been aiming to get some of this and they had the other had another kind that was a bigger can but it also a bigger price so i just went ahead and got this because i don't bake much but i do need that i've been aiming to give me some i keep forgetting it now the, i hit a i hit a jackpot here i call it a jackpot anytime you're saving money you're hitting a jackpot am i right or am i right so anyway i love asparagus and I do love the the long, uh, the the long uh, whatever you want to call it here, the long kind, <laughs> the whole stock. <laughs> um, they had a few of these sitting on the shelf, marked down to two twenty four from. Uh, it's usually let's see the price is on here somewhere. I pay two. Hmm. 224. I usually pay 224. No, 224. Wait a minute. Hold the phone. No, 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 no. That's what it's marked down to. 270 something is what I usually pay for. 270 something. I think it's 270 something. And I don't jacked up the price because it says right here you, uh, I say 74 cents. So 224. So that's what I usually pay for those, so they must have jacked up the price again. But anyway, the only they're not out of date. Um, this is uh, best if used by August 26, 2026. So, reason being, the can is bent. The cans are bent. But I don't care. As long as I can flip the top off, I can get that stuff out of there, and the tops is fine. So I picked up two four four and see the tops are fine. Six. They had some more, but I you know, want to save some for somebody else that likes to buy like that. There's just you know the this one doesn't even this one's oh wow, it's got a little bitty dent right there. I mean this one's got a big dent. And we've got a little dent over here. I don't care. It doesn't matter to me. I'm still not going to spoil the food. Because if it was spoiled, um, it would be leaking. If there was a hole somewhere. So, must have had a wreck. Truck on truck. Railroad. You know, whatever. That's usually how you get bent stuff. Hang on a minute. I usually show my my stuff by turning the camera around doing it that way. Lily, if you don't get out of them bags, I'm going to get you. No, no, no. No. Got two, whoops, picked up two bacons. I am missing my bacon. I quit eating it for there for a while because it was kind of making me nauseous. I don't know why. My stomach's been bothering me quite a bit here lately. I picked up two Kraft Spaghetti Classics. These are our favorite. I'd rather have this than anything else. Why? Because the sauce. The sauce in these are so good. Better than anything. They're just right. I don't know what all they use. I mean, I read the ingredients, but I don't know. Just so good. So this is our, pref our preference. Preference. Hang on. 
<laughs> Everything's scattered down here in Florida. Hang on. Also, there's a loaf of uh, white bread over there and wheat bread. I'm not going to get that and show it. Now, this is new to me. I mean, I don't know if it's new or not. I remember they used to make these all the time. They used to have these. I used to buy them. It was in, kind of in a smaller container. But I saw this. I thought, okay. Because Walmart's cakes that we buy that they've already made in the uh, deli or uh, the bakery, whatever. It's all the same. Um, I don't know. The cake is just not that great anymore. And it's $11 or something for a double layer of nine, eight or nine inch round cake. It's full of icing, which I love, but don't need that much. I saw this kit here by Duncan Hines. And Easy Cake Kit includes cake mix, six inch pan, and ready to spread frosting. Microwaves in about two minutes. I used to get these all the time and microwave me a cake back and that was before i started doing cakes and de decorating cakes <laughs> done that for a long time oh uh, yeah i've been, been a jack of all trades i guess you could say i picked up i think it was four more yeah i picked up four of these uh the idahoan these are our go-to staple here at this house. I keep a stockpile of, the, of these potatoes. These are Baby Red's mashed potatoes. They're homestyle red and russet potatoes with skins. Perfectly blended with creamy butter. And all you do is boil two cups of water, you know, get it real hot, in your microwave and sprinkle this in there. And they taste like regular potatoes. I, I mean, I just... It's a must. It's a must, must, must. I like those, but I love these. <laughs> these are my favorite. This is butter and herb mashed potatoes. Made with 100% real Idaho potatoes. Perfectly blended with butter and parsley. I have come a, become a parsleyaholic or something. I love parsley. I'll put it on my... If there's a potato or even in my soups. Heck, I, I'm, lately I'm a thinking about putting it on my eggs <laughs> i love parsley it just is a flavor i picked me a couple of these pocky pokey my son years ago when he was working at walmart before he got married he, he brought home a pack of these right here and i fell in love with them at that time what they are is chocolate chocolate cream covered biscuit sticks now they're not very big they're just small and i the the price they did raise the price on these and i think they lowered the price or something but i looked at my uh my receipt and it was 90 something cents so they're 90 something cents and you get a few of them 1.41 ounces so I just picked up a couple for me. I don't even know if Gary... I don't think Gary likes them. Anyway, these are my potatoes. I have to put those away. Hang on. Okay. I'm going to run and go get things. <laughs> picked up a five-pound bag of russet potatoes. And that's upside down, isn't it? There we go. Russet potatoes. I'm a potato eater from uh, Rio Grande, y'all. I love my taters. I'm a tater girl. Have been all my life. I like taters anyway. You fix them. <laughs> Another, uh, I always call these a five pound, but it's a four pound. I don't know why they started even making four pounds. Anyway, of uh, the best buy, of, well, great value that is, granulated sugar. I have one in the refrigerator already, but I keep an extra. I mean, I, 
I'm always, I gotta have sugar with my coffee. I mean, I just do. These are my favorite now. The Mixed Vegetable Medley. So I picked up six cans. I'm not going to show you all six cans, but I picked up six cans of the, these here. Great for your soup. <coughs> she sees a mother outside. Oh boy. Must be Gary. We picked up four uh, sweet potatoes. Well, this one looks different. A little different, but same. Anyway, Gary picked these out. I'm, I'm more careful. I think I got four. I think you got four. You get three. I guess, I guess you only got four. Okay. Lily! He got four sweet potatoes and then four Idaho potatoes. These are just for a quick baked potato. All right, let's see. Okay. I'm going to swing you all around, swing you around, swing you around. The Deli Fresh Turkey Breast. Got the pack of that. Gary got an eight pack of. Let me just turn you all around. I hate to show my messy refrigerator. Got him a. Uh, 18 pack of um, eggs. Eggs. My goodness. I got me another pack of my cheese. Dairy free cheese. I'm so glad they got that. They didn't have the they didn't have the um, the American cheese in the shredded. So I went ahead and got mozzarella. It's good, too. Of course, Gary, now he gets to eat the regular cheese. Like he can. I used to be a big cheese eater. And I have some left, see. You get a pretty long, um, um, ex before it expires, that is. Or your best buy or whatever. Okay, let's see. Uh, he's got, oh, he got another one when he went today. Okay, these are mine. These are mine. These are what I eat. Great value egg makers. I love these things. This is best. I don't eat regular eggs. It's a liquid egg substitute. So I've got four. No, I've, got, yeah, I've got four of those for this month. See what my little thief did? She stole my, uh, what you call these? She, she stole it out of my boots, my new boots. I got to wear them for the first time last night. Yay! I picked up a pack of these right here, these beef steaks. So we can have some beef. Uh, and I picked up another pack of... Come here, you. The, grill, the Tyson Grilled and Ready... Oven roasted diced chicken breast. Oh yeah, I forgot to show y'all the um got me some salad. My goodness, they was wiped out of salad too. It was really weird. The package they had lettuce uh heads, but I don't like that anymore really. Picked another pack of these up. These are really good. And I was aiming to get Gary. Uh he likes the I have this, which I can't. It lasts me two days. You know, so not just one time. Um, he likes the um, meatloaf. I don't. Um, it bothers my stomach. It doesn't agree with me. And I have this. And then I make whatever else with it. There it is. My classic ice iceberg salad mix right here. They were... And the expiration date on it is the 17th, so I got a little ways to go on that. I think, I think that's all, y'all. 
I believe I believe that is it for my haul grocery haul thinking I'm thinking there's something else I guess because I'm so used to buying a great big bill of groceries instead of which hang on a minute which is there's this one and there's this one because Gary um, the super center last night was out of my egg substitute that I that I eat and it was something else so he went today to the neighborhood Walmart and they it was fully stocked there I said now yeah it's because no one goes there so just to show you what uh, I might have left out some things that we bought but I think I got everything I think I showed you everything anyway um, subtotal is 170.37 to the two taxes we get two tax twice I don't know if y'all do 241 and 321 and it uh, the total was $175.99 that's what it cost us last night for what I showed you. I think I showed you everything. And today when Gary went, when he went, got the egg substitute, he got the bacon, he got, today he got the bacon and the egg substitute. He got um, my bread. My bread is very expensive, but I don't eat as much bread as he does. I have to have wheat bread. It helps with my irritable bowel syndrome so anyway this is the best it really is the nature zone it's three dollars and something a loaf uh, but it is delicious I am hooked on this bread I love it but if I can't get it I'm fine with uh, whatever wheat bread I can get but it just don't taste the same you know I'm not picky about my foods just not everything i'm not my tummy is <laughs> so anyway y'all um i'm gonna i'm hoping to get to go to aldi's because there's some things i'm gonna need to pick up at aldi's uh that uh some things i can't get at walmart so so anyway thank you all so much for watching and i sure appreciate it Please share, like, and subscribe, and I will see you in my next video. My whole video is coming up, y'all. See you later. Love y'all. God bless.